Now is the time to get your head in the right place for the new year. I know it seems a bit away, but now is the time. Now is the time to ensure that you are in the correct state of mind to achieve all the things that you want to achieve and more in the coming year. I don't mean that now is the time to plan for the new year because from a personal point of view planning never really got anybody anywhere because if you think about it all the best things in life have happened to you, simply happened. You didn't plan them. Now of course if you do have to plan from a business point of view then why plan in the normal way like every other normal business? Surely in business our objective is to differentiate ourselves from the competition, is to gain competitive advantage. In other words, to be different so that potential customers will notice the difference and we'll win an advantage. And yet, the vast, vast majority of businesses, even those seeking to differentiate themselves, even those seeking major competitive advantage, are all managed in the same normal way by normal people. Who among you wants to have a normal business? Who among you wants to just have the same thing as everybody else has? If you want your business to be super successful, extraordinarily successful in the coming year, then you need to manage your business differently. You need to, as I said, if you need to plan for the coming year from a business point of view, you need to plan differently. Now most businesses plan for the coming year on the basis of what they've done this year, which is an absolute load of nonsense. Why not look at what your business is truly capable of, what your senior people are truly capable of, what those in your employ are really, really capable of. Why not look at things the other way around? Not what we did this year, but what we could truly do. Why not, in other words, to use an awful cliche, think outside the box? I'm sorry about that. In order for you to have an abnormal business, it's kind of blindingly obvious that you need to act differently. You need to be abnormal yourself. And that is what I meant at the start of this seminar by saying that now is the time to get your head in gear. You need to ensure that you act differently because otherwise next year will simply be an extension of this year. Now you may actually say to yourself, okay, well, we've experienced challenging times from a business point of view this year. But there are plenty of businesses that are thriving in the current so-called challenging times. And there are even more businesses, unfortunately, who look to the challenging times as some, core, some sort of cop-out. That, oh, we did all right this year, and because we did all right, we should clap ourselves on the back for at least not, not having gone under. Load of nonsense. If you want your business to thrive, if you want your business to be exceptionally different and exceptionally successful, you need to be exceptionally different yourself. And that starts in here. It starts in the way you manage your mind. It starts in the way you behave towards the people from whom you want to get the best. It depends on the way you draw out their own inner power. And unfortunately, you can't do that without drawing out yours first. So, as a starter, in terms of looking forward to, towards the coming year, you need to look inward now. You need to look inward to ensure that you are able to develop a clear and present state of mind. Because only a clear and present state of mind will enable you rise head and shoulders above the competition from a business point of view. And of course, the benefits don't just stop there. Because if you do develop your clear and present mind, if you do manage to turn yourself on and differentiate yourself from all the other mad normal people, then in every aspect of your life, you, through clarity and presence of mind, 
will exude a presence that is not only impressive, but will enable other people do their very best too. Isn't that worth trying? No, it isn't worth trying. It's worth doing.